try to find the uh, ABV. Hello everybody and welcome to Honey and Bear's Beverage Review. Today we are reviewing Harji Bev's Wowie Colada. Wowie. 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 Pineapple and passion fruit colada. Uh, it's by Ryan Guys Breweries. Ryan Guys Breweries is out of Cincinnati, Ohio. We've had many and many of our uh, Ryan Guys products. Overall, we've usually enjoyed most of their products. Uh, mm. They kill it with the RG Bevs. Their ciders are hit and miss. You guys could start up your cider game, but it's good. You've got a lot of flavors for a lot of people, put it that way, with the cider game. Mm -hmm. they, they, they do. They have a lot of ciders for a lot of people. That's and then true. their beers, just hit and miss, but they, they overall, they're a pretty, pretty cool brewery, man. And uh, we recently actually drove past one of their, their brewery in Cincy. Cool. It really was. If they're independent. Mm -hmm. We got the independent craft label. The government warns them not to do things whilst drunken. But, you know, yeah. yeah. I'll feel your Twitter. I smell can. Yeah, okay. Can. Getting a little bit of fruit out of the bubbles kind of subsided. Oh, okay. so, yeah. oh, there it is. Yeah, the bubbles right, totally like... When I first like... cracked it, I smelt the can. I yeah, just, I, just, I didn't smell anything. Smell the stunk of can. Like it just... And then, like she said, it kind of... You heard the... And that kind of died off. And now it's like a... A coconut is trying to punch me through the, the can hole. Pineapple. It's no coconut. Pineapple. Oh, God. Whatever, I don't know. Whatever. Fruit. Fruit. I wasn't really going for your head. No, it was not. Super clear, super light color. It's not, not a lot of bubble it's actually. It's not a beer, on. so I'm not I'm not looking for a huge head. I'm not, you know, it, it's uh Oh wow, that's got a lot of smoke coming out of there. That's amazing. Oh wow, yeah. That's a lot of good smells coming out of there now. Mm -hmm, that's um, super fruity. Colors kind of what I would expect. Mm -hmm. Again, this is a brew, this is not a beer. So it, it's, you know, it is what it is. There's a spider web that I keep kicking down there. I'm, I'm kind of excited so far. Um, so far they're, they're, yeah, I'm excited. Cheers. Cheers. Wow. Wow. I give it a 9.3. Good. I mean, it's good. It's, it's wow, really good. I never read it right off the rip like that. I can't really. There's not too much. I mean, it's really just good. It's really well crafted. It's not over sugary. It's not over fruity with any one thing. Yeah, you it's can... like a pina colada that you want to drink, but it's not quite a pina colada. It's, yeah. It's a wowie colada. That's... It's like a pina colada with all the guilt, you know? Because it's not all that, like... Wow. That is, this is a very impressive drink, like... It's really not over sugary? Like, what? Well, I got... Passion fruit can be... 
passion fruit can be a gamble in drinks. Like sometimes people put passion fruit in and they like way overdo it, and that's all you can taste is just passion fruit. And it's like passion fruit's good, but then it becomes a little overrated when it's like that's the only thing that that you There's can. There's only taste. ten grams of sugar. <laughs> um, I had to look because it's not too sugary, you know. So I, ha I had to look. I agree. I bet you they use dextrose though. It is. It wait, is wait, nice. wait. And I'm not getting. You mean the sucrose? So, uh, I don't taste it. I'm not tasting that weird aftertaste. They, yeah, they yeah, they did. Yeah, they put dextrose. It's not over, it's not, you know what though, you don't taste the dextrose. Yeah, no you don't. So it's not overpowering with fake sugar, it's it's real good. I'm sticking to my 93, I like it, I'd rebuy it. It's a great price point. Damn good job, again, right? Good job, I got it, I got it, I got it. I'd gift it, I'd buy it. Filtration's great, clarity's great, cool color for what you think it is. It's, yeah. You know what, I think I'm, I'm gonna. My drink. I'm gonna match you with that nine three, like because I can, like I can be kind of picky about colada stuff, pina colada stuff. It's usually somebody like way overdoes it with the fruity. This is a very nice balance. It's very light. It tastes, you know, it's it's very refreshing. Uh, it's not over carbonated. It's not under carbonated. Like it's overall, it's good. I love. No, look at it. It's like kind of like a beer. Yeah, like my yeah, my head yeah, still. That's like, the thing that's doing it just like a beer would. It's gorgeous. You can like tell each flavor too. So that's really cool. When you like move around your mouth like you can taste each flavor. It's, it's really, really fantastic. So, um, yeah, with that being said, uh, let us know what you think in the comments below. Uh, definitely would give this one a try if you get yeah, a chance yeah. to. This is a fantastic beverage. So definitely let us know what you think in the comments below. Anywhere in the Midwest, go pick this up. Mm -hmm. Try it. It's worth it. It's worth 10 bucks to try a six pack of this. Yeah. So yeah, don't forget to give us a like at our videos as well. Check out our other reviews also. And then don't forget to subscribe to our page and hit the little bell notification so you can stay informed when we get new uh, videos out to you. Happy little burps. Aloha.